All right, we're finally live. Today on MTGM Pet, we're going to be putting together the patron snack packs. So if you're not familiar with that, we go through these patron boxes here, pull out a whole bunch of cards for patrons and set them aside. So this month we have cards from Rudy from Alpha Investments. So he cracked a couple of boxes of Corset 2020. Uh, also got the Goodwill random buy that we've uh, been going through lately. So there are a couple of videos of that. And also the 36 pack feast that you may have seen yesterday. So very cool. Let me know in the comments if there are any audio issues, if everything's coming through loud and clear. And we will get started. So let's see who we've got here. Whole bunch of people already. Oh, Richard Corwin. Ding, 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 ding. Thank you very much for the super chat, sir. Hello, Unpacked, and good morning to all. Time for Epicosity, indeed. All right, who else do we have? Ink Junkie 101, Michael Shoop, You Mad Bra 99, SPNKS. And scrolling through here. Did I miss anyone? Oh, we've got some newcomers here. Welcome, Dylan Moore, Lucas Gomez, Peter Sorensen, Leandrotz22. All right, so, oh, and Ben P. And I need to make a couple more people moderators. How do I do this? Let's see if I can set that up. One moment. All right, so if you too would like to become a patron like the fine patrons here, there's a link to the MTG Unpacked Patreon in the description for this video. Also a new thing we have are the YouTube, uh, what do they call them, like channel memberships. So with that, it's like two bucks a month, you get your name in the credits for each video. Uh, as long as you're a member and you also get a little icon next to your name. So if you've seen that in the chat, that's what that's all about. We've got a couple of members there already. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go through. We have huge piles of envelopes here. We're going to be looking for patrons. So let's see. I'd like to start with the patrons who are here in the chat. So digging through the piles. Oh, here's one. Hopefully I don't have an avalanche here because this is getting pretty crazy. Okay, so that will get us started, I think. All right, so let's go. So we have Anton Peterkin. So at this tier, he gets a foil each month from the snack pack box. So let's move things around here. Ajani is guarding the packs here. Okay, so we will grab a foil here for Anton. And what do we have for Anton? It is a renowned weaponsmith from M20. Very cool. So get some nice look at the foiling there. All right, so thank you for being a patron, Anton. And moving right along. Oh, hairy arm vision. There we go. Watch out, Rudy. We have Mike R. So we'll get a foil for him. And what's it going to be? An Angel of the Dawn from M19. Whoa. Some nice foiling on that one. All right, so thank you for being a patron, Mike. Now we move on to the juicy snap packs. This is where we get five commons, five uncommons, a foil and a rare or mythic for the patrons. There are also a couple of other little surprises here. And let's scroll through the chat, see what's been going on. Okay, so we have 
You mad brass, because he needs his snap pack to be in the witch voice, please. That could be difficult. I think we've got over 50 snap packs to do today. So we'll see how my voice is holding up. Uh, Richard Corwin says, blame Mr. Bevers for my patronage. Yes, good old Mr. Bevers. If you are not a subscriber to Mr. Bevers, what are you doing? Get over there right now. Subscribe to Mr. Bevers. Let's give him a nice surprise if you're not already subscribed. Okay, what else do we have? A lot of people just waking up. All right, so I hope this will be a nice morning for you. Let's go. We have Richard Corwin. New patron gets his signed Jackalope Herd card there. And we will dig into the boxes and see what we can get. It's pretty stuffed full, so these first couple are going to be a little slower. So feel free to chat in the comments or fast forward if you're watching this later. Okay, so we have five commons, a double-faced card. Okay, so we've got a bit of a peek at that one. I'm well, thank you, Jack of all trades. Okay, so do a quick count here. All right, and then a foil and a rare or mythic. All right, good luck, sir. Thank you for being a patron. What do we have for you today? We have bladed braces. That's pretty cool. What is that? Avison restored, I think. Inspired charge. Charging griffin. Siege worm. Priest of Erus. This is the uh, double face card here. Gatstaff shepherd. Flips around into a Gatstaff howler. Werewolf. All right, quasi-duplicate. Oh, okay, so I've been chucking in extra rares now and then. So this is a sorcery for three credit token. It's copy of target creature you control has jumpstart. Very nice. Throne of Geth. So this is one from the Goodwill box. You'll notice uh, usually the cards are like near mint because I just pull them out of the packs. There are going to be a bunch this month. Might have a bit of wear and tear to them, but hopefully... Not too much of a concern. Next we have Flame Wave Invoker. And another rare. Okay, Pixis of Pandemonium. Very cool. And your foil is a Cation Crier. And the final rare here. So these, these rares are usually, I try to get them over a dollar each. So in the rare or mythic slot. So this is the Elvish Reclaimer from M20. All right, so there we are, Richard. Thank you for being a patron, sir. I'll tuck this aside and see if I can avoid an avalanche here. Okay, so who do we have next? Let's go with this guy, Dylan Moore. And he has already done rather nicely for himself. He's got his foil Garrick Planeswalker, who incidentally, if you had not heard the news, he is back in Throne of Eldraine. So looking forward to seeing that. So good luck, sir. Let's pull the commons here. Okay, and then uncommons. And I used to do this bit in uh, fast forward when I was editing, but it ended up taking me the whole weekend. I had to edit like four videos, I think. So that was pretty much the weekend shot, but this is very nice. Get to do everything in one hit. All right, Dylan, let's get stuck into it. What do we have for you today? We've got a core chant, ghoul flesh, predator's gambit, Feral Invocation, Dutiful Thrall, Uncommon's Cogwork Assembler, Strength from the Fallen, Kragma Warcaller, Archetype of Endurance, 
elegant edge crafters and a foil screaming seahawk. And the rare is Yahani, Undying Partisan. So this one's pretty cool. I played this uh, a lot back when it was in standard. This is from Aether Revolt. Very cool. All right, so there we go, Dylan. Thank you for being a patron. And we shall move on. Who do we have next? Oh, the next patron has two snack packs due. That is Peter Sorensen. Thank you for being a patron, sir. We will dig in here and see what we can find. You're welcome, Dylan. Okay, that's five. And a foil and a rare. Okay, Peter, first snack pack. An Ink Junkie 101 says he had tattoos for a living, so his work day is 14 hours. Oof. Well, I hope it's uh, th those 14 hours pass by pretty quickly. Okay, we have Cruel Feeding, Ghoul Caller's Accomplice, Gurmag Drowner, Pyrophobia, Expedition Map, I think that was from the Goodwill box, Wing Shards, Nessian Asp, Arishan Warbeast, Eidolon of Rhetoric, Foundry Inspector, I think that was over a buck these days, and a Foil, Death Cult Rogue, it's another one from the uh, Goodwill box. I like the uh, guild symbol down there. And the rare is Leyline of Anticipation. All right, so there are a bunch of Leylines in here. I did put aside the Leyline of the Void. I had a foil and a regular version from Rudy. So those are for me, but everything else just about went into the Snap Pack box. And he's back. Peter Sorensen wanted seconds, so I am happy to oblige. Let's do the pulls here. The foil and the rare. Okay, Peter, what can we do on the second snap pack here? And looks like Tragic MTG has a new video out, so I'm going to be watching that uh, after this is over. Very cool. Okay, so Peter, we have Font of Return, Scrapskin Drake, Fists of Flame. Rafter Demon, Death Bloom Thalad, Mockrat Necropod, Fight with Fire, Unclaimed Territory, Solidarity of Heroes, and here he is, Ajani, fantastic. Vajuran Emissary, and what is that set symbol? This is another one from the Goodwill box, and there's a bunch of sets. I have no idea what they are. All right. And a foil Loxodon line breaker. That is pretty bright. And the rare is Wall of Reverence from Ultimate Masters. All right, so there we are, Peter. That is the second snack pack for you. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Much appreciated. Okay, now I need to dig through another pile here. See, these guys aren't in here yet. Oh, this guy is. This guy, holy moly, he really enjoys his snap packs, I will say. He <laughs> you can probably guess who it is. If you can't, you'll find out momentarily. So this guy, four snap packs. He is probably the hungriest consumer of snap packs. We have Ink Junkie 101. Here he is. 
And he's got his foil Garrick there already. No, it is not Jeremy, although Jeremy does appreciate a good snap pack. So we're going to dig into the second box here. See if I can do this a little quicker. So thank you for being a patron, Ink Junkie 101. We have four snap packs for you. So let's see, three, four, five, and uncommons. Okay, move to the side and grab a foil. And a rare. Happy birthday, Joseph. Welcome. It's pretty early on here, so <laughs> Ink Chunky 101 says greed monster. Okay, let's see if that greed paid off. We have Griffin Sentinel, Vault Scourge, Sip of Hemlock, Banners Raised, Wildwood Geist, Solidarity of Heroes. Here he is, Johnny. Spectral Sailor, Vizier of the Scorpion, Farmstead Gleaner, that is creepy, Chronicler of Heroes, and a foil, Satyr Wayfinder, and the rare is brought back. Okay, so there we are, that is the first snap pack, and we had a question in the chat from Jack of All Trades, what's your favourite prop you own? Good question. I'm getting close to 400 now, so that's a tough decision. I'd have to say any of the Pennywises, the 10-inch Pennywise, it's pretty huge. Um, did a video on that the other day. That was pretty fun. So that is on my other channel, Pop Sideshow. If you haven't checked that out already, you might want to go take a look. Okay, Ink Junkie 101, number two. Let's see how we do on the second one. Yeah, they've got a bunch of um, Pennywise pops out because the new movie came out. <laughs> Richard says, Howard the Duck. Yeah, I do have a soft spot for Howard. He is in a lot of my videos on that channel. Pretty much all of the skits. We do these dumb little uh, skits at the end of each video where I do my weird voices. So if you like the weird voices, you might want to check that out. World War Dragons Gaming Menards was selling a life-size Pennywise for Halloween. Craziness. Okay. We have Asphyxiate Sanitarium Skeleton. Hopefully not us, because that is what happens if you don't get the crazy pulls. Mind Static Titanic Brawl. Compulsive Research Archetype of Endurance. Bread for the Hunt. And an extra rare just chucked in there. Trading Post from M14. Heaven Ghoul Vampire, Charging Tuscadon, Pacifism, and, oh, okay, sorry, that was a, that is your foil pacifism, look at that, isn't it blinding, whoa, craziness, and your rare, spoiler, here he is, Rotting Regisaur, yeah, I, I would say he's gone past the point of rotting, he's now just a pile of bones, Although, eh, maybe there's some weird uh, purple stuff holding him together. All right, so there we are, Ink Junkie 101, snap pack number two. And let's see what's happening in the chat. SPNKS says he hasn't seen either of the It movies. Um, so I've seen the first one. Uh, it's pretty hokey, like, uh, not really scary, more creepy, like, weird, crazy clannish goodness so yeah i enjoyed that one um probably won't get to see the second one until it hits um blu-ray and what else richard corwin is that last mystery box still available yes it is indeed it is waiting for somebody to pick it up so send me a message on patreon if you're interested in that one and we'll hook you up with that if you like it Okay, so, he's back! 
Ink Junkie 101. What a surprise. Okay, number three. Let's see. World War Dragons Gaming says the creepiest moment he thinks in the first one was in the library. Yeah, that was pretty creepy. Okay, uncommons. Now for the foil. And... The rare or mythic. Good luck, sir. We have Druid of the Cowl, Ring Flesh, Snare Spinner, Renegade Demon, Devkaran Dissident, Sorcerer's Strongbox for the Uncommons, Make Obsolete, Dusk Feaster. Uh, yeah, I agree, Michael. The book is a great read. I've, I used to be a huge Stephen King fan. I haven't read any in quite a while, but I was reading everything he was putting out, so it was one of my favourites. Burnished Heart, Battlewise Hoplite, and a Foil Rare. Whoa, a Thames All Seeing. I mean, it's not a, a crazy pull, but you don't see Foil Rares too often. And a Mythic! Cavalier of Dawn from M20. Very cool pull there, sir. And there are a bunch of other Cavaliers in this month's box, so we'll keep an eye out for those. And finally, number four. Oh, Pet Cemetery. Yeah, that was creepy, creepy book. Um, I always say that um, our cat, one of our cats, he, we think he had a stroke or something. He's just never been the same. I say he's like that cat in Pet Cemetery. It's like something off about that animal. It's very sad, but he's still alive and kicking, so we're happy about that at least. Okay, so final snap pack. Ooh, white border. Juggernaut. Now, these are tricky. This could be like fourth or fifth edition. You've got to look at the text here. I usually can't tell just by looking at it. We have Crawl Stinger, Alchemist's Apprentice, Marauder's Axe, Hunger of the Halpak, Gruel Charm, Sea God's Revenge, Guardian of the Gateless, and an extra rare here, Hanged Executioner, and Peter says that white border card was probably revised. It could be. Uh, Maverick Thopterist. And another foil rare. What the heck? We got a Skyship Stalker. Dragon. And the rare is Solemnity. Yes, this was a fun one back in the day. Players can't get counters. Counters can't be put on artifacts, creatures, enchantments, or lands. That is a good hosing card. And uh, what is that? Hour of Devastation. That was fun times. Okay, so there we are for Ink Junkie 101. And now we have someone else who is hungry for snack packs. That is SPNKS. Thank you for being a patron, sir. So he has two. We'll be putting those together for him now. Okay, and it's speeding up now that I can actually reach in here and not have to uh, force the cards apart. Okay, so that is those. And then a foil. And a rare or mythic. Good luck, sir. <laughs> Slaughter cry! That is hilarious. Love the goblins. Okay, ponder. So that's a decent pull. That's a buck or two. Bloodflow connoisseur. Humbler of Mortals, and Richard says Solemnity is a very good commander card too. I imagine it would be, that'd hose everybody. Satessin Griffin, Dark Betrayal, Whirler Virtuoso, and an extra rare here, Endless One. Raiders Spoils, Erebus's Emissary, and a Foil, Daybreak Chaplain. With the rare is the Rotting Regisaur. You thought you saw the last of this bloke, but here he is again. I still don't think he's rotting. Maybe by this point, 
Oh, pretty soon he'll turn into dust. Okay, so we'll set that aside. SPNKS number two. Let's dig into it. And everybody's uh, talking about movies in the chat. Hollywood's gotten lazy. They've run out of ideas. It's honestly, it's a wonder that movies get made when you, if you ever read about uh, all the stuff that goes on, how difficult it is, how many parts have to be coordinated. Although there are low budget stuff, they could do a lot more low budget stuff that would uh, not have these crazy effects and everything. Okay. Pack number two for SPNKS, we have Elvish Pioneer. Not sure what that symbol is. Is it Judgment? Leave a note in the chat or comments. We have Seal of Strength. Ravenous Rats! Nice to see the rats. Pressure Point. Fortress Crab. Invigorated Rampage. That was a fun little combat trick back in the day. Grave Robber Spider. Ordeal of Heliod. Heliod's Emissary. Thunderherd Migration, and a foil, Gift of Paradise, and the rare is Mystic Forge. Not bad. That's a pretty good one. So you may look at the top card of your library anytime. You may cast the top card of your library if it's an artifact card or a colorless non-land card. You can tap, pay one life, and exile the top card of your library. Okay, so there we are, SPNKS. I'm going to set aside this pile of envelopes now. We've got stuff everywhere here. All right, you're welcome, SPNKS. Yes, Michael, there are rares in the uncommon slot. I've scattered a bunch. If it's less than a dollar, it usually gets chucked into the uncommon slot so that you will see a bunch of those today. Okay, so who else do we have? Actually, did I miss one? This is partially why I was late. I was looking through, okay. Yeah, so Richard, I owe you another one. So Richard Corwin, he's back for seconds. I thought I'd forgotten, but luckily I had another envelope there. So let's see, three, four, five. Okay, and then the foil yeah i'm scattered all over the place i'm always scattered all over the place but it's usually cleverly hidden okay we have havenwood worm wall of mist murmuring phantasm metathran soldier from urza's i think that was from the uh, goodwill box champion of arishan join shields uncommons karazda guild mage morbid curiosity reassembling skeleton nephalia academy and a foil pestilent spirit and rare is solemn simulacrum i think that's how you say it from m12 so that's another one out of the goodwill box so thank you for being a patron once again, Richard. Sorry about that. I would have done that earlier, but my envelopes are all in disarray. Okay, so what's going on in the chat? Uh, talking about the Star Wars movies. I did think Rogue One was pretty good. I was surprised by that one too, yeah. Uh, Diego, Diego Saka says, mind rot, question mark. Yes, you are rotting your mind currently. I'm sorry about that. But if you keep watching, I'm sure these symptoms will improve. Okay, so who do we have next? Oh, this guy. He is in the chat. Well, let's see if there's anyone else who has joined. Okay, so next up we have J 
Jack of all trades. Thank you for being a patron, sir. We will dig in. We've got two, three, four, and five. Alrighty, and a foil and rare or mythic. Okay, good luck, Jack of all trades. We have Kazmina's transmutation. Whoops, spoilers. Goblin assault team, there they are. Devout harpist, nice. I think that's Urza's as well. That must be from the Goodwill box. Maze behemoth. Grixus Grimblade, what is that set symbol? I saw this one earlier, I'm like, what is that? No idea, Runaway Carriage, Uncommons, Commander's Authority, Hunt the Hunter, Fairgrounds Warden, and just a random ley line of combustion thrown in, so you get an extra rare there. And Jack of all trades thinks it's Shards of Alara. And a foil, Spidery Grasp. And the rare is Golos Tireless Pilgrim. All right, from M20. There we are, sir. Thank you for being a patron. You Mad Brass says, what's your favorite card from Throne of Eldraine? I can answer this without hesitation. Uh, what is, what's his name? Ginger Brute. He is the highlight of the set. Uh, if you ask me about the mechanics, I have no idea. I've still got to go through all of that. I'll know more once I'm cracking packs. All right, so let's see. World War Dragons Gaming says, no, that wasn't Shards of Alara. Everybody's frantically rewinding. What was it? Okay, so I think, yep, this guy is in the chat. A couple of other people. How about these guys? Next up, it's You Mad Bra 99. So he got a very nice thing there, a foil promo planeswalker. So let's put together a snap pack. And a foil. No wild cards. What is going on? You're right, SPNKS. It's stuffed full of wild cards, but I haven't seen any yet. And if you are wondering what a wild card is, I'm sure you won't have to wait too much longer. Okay, we have Fire Fiend Elemental, Scrapyard Salvo, Findhorn Elder from Ice Age. That's another one from the... Uh, Goodwill box. Graf Rats from Eldritch Moon flips into Chittering Host. So this was that meld mechanic, I think. You'd get two cards, had to put them together. Very cool. Wall of Mist. Barter in Blood. Switcheroo. Tormod's Crypt. So this is a, I would say, let's take a look. Is that a, I would say that's a heavy play. That's also from the Goodwill box. Ugin's Conjurant. Drill bit! Hilarious! Yes! And I don't know why, but this always reminds me of the dentist. Um, I haven't had any cavities filled in a long while, so thankfully that has not been me in recent times. And a foil, Ring of Colonia. And the rare is Steel Overseer from M20. And actually a bunch of these M20 cards I think were pulled by Rudy's Hairy Arms in that video. So if you haven't seen that, I think I posted it in the uh, community section of the channel. So you can check it out. Okay, next up. Thank you for being a patron, by the way, you mad bra 99. We have Michael Shoop. So, thank you for being a patron, sir. Let's dig into it. And, of course, the foil. World War Dragons Gaming says, What's the next future set everyone's excited for? 
Yeah, you've always got to you always got to be thinking of the next one. What's the next one? The next one after that. So what do we have next year? They announced all the standard ones: the Theros. Um, uh, forget what that was called. Beyond something. Um, we've got Corset twenty twenty one. We've got a new Zendikar, and what is that one about? The is it Ikoria? Something about the behemoths. I'm terrible. I can't remember. Watsy, I'm sorry. Okay. We have Hunter's Ambush, Horncaller's Chant, Reckless Airstrike, Frontier Mastodon, Angelic Gift, Ikoria Lair of Behemoths. That's the one. So that's in the second quarter next year. Nether Spirit, an extra rare. Warlord's Axe, Triton Fortune Hunter, Giant Oyster, which I believe, I looked that up, I think this is supposedly a rare, although you couldn't really tell from that. Horizon Chimera and a Foil Tarcrop Skirmisher. And the rare is Legion's End from M20. All right, so there we are, Michael. Thank you for being a patron once again. I believe Michael at this point, he's probably the longest continuous... Uh, patron of the channel. If you look at the credits, you'll notice it's a lot of it is um, when you became a patron. So if you're a recent patron, your name will go on the end of the list. But if you've been here a long time, you're right up at the beginning. So thank you once again, Michael. Let's move on. Okay, we have Cosmo. I don't know if Cosmo's here, but uh, we already did a bundle for him earlier in the month so now we're going to do his snap pack and then i'll be mailing that out soon yeah sp and care says someone's about to get a full snap pack of wild cards seriously where are they what's going on oh i thought i loaded it up previous videos i kept i think ink junkie 101 just scored like tons of them in a previous video that was last month. Okay, let's go, Cosmo. We have Predators, Gambit, Lagona Band, Elder, Fiery Hellhound, Defiant Ogre. Welcome, Dawson Haraga. I am doing rather nicely today. Thank you very much. Alesha's Vanguard, Triton Fortune Hunter, Outland Boar, Third. And an extra rare chucked in here, Crackling Doom. Fact or Fiction, Rage Munger, so a foil, look at that falling, astonishing, and the rare is Cloud Shredder Sliver, fantastic from Modern Horizons, all right, so let's set this stuff aside, and at some point, I'm hoping today, I'll be announcing um, what's coming up next for the boxes for patrons next month. Of course, Throne of Eldraine will be there. And Richard sent me a message on Patreon. Okay, so I will check that after the video. Thank you, sir. We'll tee that up for you. Uh, let's see. You mad, Brian 99 says that 36 pack video was crazy. Yeah, it took me almost a month. I had probably like half of the the packs already and I had to order a whole bunch more so they took a couple of weeks to come in. Next up we have Jonathan Vogel Sang and he's got his Najila the Blade Blossom or Nahila, how do you pronounce that? Leave it in the chat or comments. So we will get digging here. Thank you for being a patron Jonathan. Sooner or later we're gonna get a wild card or three. Any time now. Okay, and a foil and rare or mythic. Let's dig in for Jonathan. We start off with Lava Axe, Rabid Bloodsucker, Opal Champion. That's pretty cool from Urza's. Grey Merchant of Asphodel, Treefolk Umbra, Gifted Aetherborn. So that's a buck or two. Shipwreck Singer. Rally to Battle, Underworld Coinsmith, 
Liliana's defeat, and we have been trolled by the Barkai troll. There he is, and the rare is Villis, Broker of Blood. Very sinister fellow. Okay, there we are, Jonathan. Thank you for being a patron. Let's tuck that in there. And this, holy moly, I think um, he's at the legendary Jackalope tier. I think we pulled a whole heap of humans and warriors. So that's the deal with that series. We look for the tribal affiliation of the commander. Okay, next up. All right, thanks for dropping by, Jack of all trades. We have Derek Nothnagel. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Let's dig into it. Okay, commons, uncommons. Up next, oh, spoiler. Hey, MTG Hermit. You missed a ton of stuff. You're going to have to watch it on the replay, unfortunately. But we have not done your snap pack yet, so you're here at a good time. I'll be digging through the envelopes there and finding yours. So let's get started here. For Derek, we have Coral Helm Guide, Eye Blight Assassin, Prophetic Prism, Juggernaut. Okay, I don't... Yeah, that must be the Juggernaut, the German version. That's pretty cool. So that is definitely from the Goodwill box. Soul Strike Technique, Gore Clan Rampager, the Uncommon Soul Caesar flips around into Ghastly Haunting, Ceremonious Rejection, Nylea's Emissary, Slimefoot the Stowaway, and a foil brought back promo card, no less. Foil rare, can't complain. And it's Khan, a great creator. Fantastic pull there for Derek. Always nice to see a Khan. All right, there we go. Let's set the aside. I think Derek probably um, has done the best out of everybody so far, unless you can remember someone else got a crazy pull, but I don't think so. All right, let's dig in. Where is MTG Hermit? He has an envelope here somewhere. I'm going to find it. Here we go. Oh, it's empty. Okay, so you actually have another video on the way uh, uh, within the next week or so, I think. Okay, MTG Hermit, thank you for being a patron, sir. Just in time. Let's get cracking here. And this box is thinning out a little, so we might go back to the other one in a moment. Yeah, maybe Hermit will drag all the wild cards out. Like, if I think the record is somebody got like three wild cards one time, it was totally ridiculous. Okay, next we have Reduced to Ashes, Frilled Sea Serpent, Skyline Scout, Fragmentize. Vodalian Mage. What on earth? That is pretty cool. Merfolk, what set is that? Not familiar with that one. I think that one was another pull from the Goodwill box. Rise from the Grave. Settled Rhyme Stag. Or Scale Guardian. Combust. Flood of Tears. And a Foil Hired Poisoner. And the rare is a mythic Kai Car Winds Fury. Nice. Bird Wizard. Has anyone done an EDH slash Commander Bird Wizard Tribal deck? I'd be curious how that works for you. Okay, there we are, MTG Hermit. And stay tuned for your pack opening coming in the next week or so. All right, next up we have Godly Swamp. New patron gets his signed Jackalope Herd card. Good luck, sir. We'll go digging in this other box now. And in case you're wondering, there are wild cards in both boxes, so should be possible to pull one sooner or later. Fallen Empires. Is that what it is, really? Oh, oh. I have not opened any Fallen Empires. I could actually afford a box of that. That's one of the few, what is it? Homelands and Fallen Empires would be easy to pick up, but I'm sort of hesitant because uh, like 
getting hosed in every pack. Okay, Godly Swamp. What do we have for you this month? Miming Slime. Hedron Crawler. Maniacal Rage. Yushin Soldier. Coldwater Snapper. Uncommons Ugin's Construct. Press into Service. Oath of Liliana. Okay, so you get an extra rare there. Shipwreck Singer. Captivating Jaya. And a foil rare promo. Whoa! Shifting Ceratops. That's pretty cool. And the rare is another Mythic Kethis, the Hidden Hand. Very cool. We are firing on all cylinders here with the Mythics coming in thick and fast. All right, there we are. Godly Swamp. Thank you for being a patron. And I think I owe you a pack opening video in the next week or so as well. Okay, moving on, we have William Lefebvre. Lefebvre, ah, I can't say it. Leave a note in the comments, William, um, how you pronounce that. Awfully sorry if I butchered your name. Okay, let's go and put a snap pack together for you, sir. And unfortunately, we are live, so I can't edit that embarrassing moment out. And you could argue that this channel is really just one long series of embarrassing moments, and I tend to agree, but that's all part of the fun. Okay, William, let's go. We have Rank Officer, Gravity Negator, Eldrazi Drone. Oh, we're getting all the Eldrazi. Must have found a pocket of them there. Eldrazi Sky Spawner, War Flare, Answered Prayers, Fertilid, Unified Will, and a random mythic just tossed in there. I think this is just under a buck, so that's why it's in the uncommon slot. Vorapede, Viral Drake, Navigator's Ruin, and a foil thicket crasher. And rare. Oh my, another mythic. It's Dovin Grand Arbiter. Planeswalker. Okay, that is pretty crazy. So, what is that? Three, is that three mythics in a row? Holy moly. Okay, so there we are, William. Thank you for being a patron. Stay tuned for your pack opening video. Next up, we have Allah and Salvo. Thank you for being a patron. Let's dig into it. And I think Salvo is in uh, Italy. Actually got his envelope for last month within a week, which I thought was astonishingly fast. So must have gone via airmail. Thanks for dropping by World War Dragons Gaming. See you next time. Okay, Ella and Salvo. Let's dig into it. We have Golgari Rotworm, Segovian Angel, Thriving Rats. Heart Piercer Bow, Return Centaur, Airy Worshippers, Void Grafter, Gloom Widow, Samet Tyrant Smasher, Wildfire Cerberus, and a Foil Rare Marauding Raptor. And the rare is brought back. Okay, so you got a couple of rares there. Very cool. And stay tuned, Salvo, for your pack opening coming up soon okay next we have brian simmons thank you for being a patron sir okay that's uncommons foil and rare or mythic so maybe we can get another Mythic here. We had a bit of a run of Mythics. What's going on here? Uh, let me check. Okay, so I missed those out of Salvo's pack because I apparently don't know how to stuff an envelope. There we are. Okay, problem solved. Brian Simmons, thank you for being a patron, sir. We have Walker of the Grove. Venomous Changeling, Laboratory Brute, Hedron Blade, Hopeful Adlon, Inferno Hellion, Reap What Is Sown, Tales End, okay, so an extra rare here, Peace Strider, 
Blood for Bones. Can you guess the artwork just by looking at that? I bet you can. And a foil, Bolas's Citadel. So this is a foil promo card. Rare, nice. And the rare is Thunderkin Awakener, Creature Elemental Shaman. All right. I'd like to see that one in foil too. That'd be pretty cool. All right, so thank you for being a patron, Brian. Yes, I can stuff envelopes. Let me set this stuff aside. Getting a huge pile of cards here. Okay, and then moving right along, we have a new patron. It is Carl Elwood. So it gets his signed Jackalope Herd card. Thank you for being a patron, sir. We will dig into the snap pack box. Hopefully we'll get a wild card sooner rather than later. I'm a little worried. I think they've uh, vanished to an alternate dimension, perhaps. Foil and rare. Okay. So let's see what we can get for Carl this month. We have an Octo Prophet. <laughs> Mind rot. Yes, I see there are still some of you here rotting your minds. That is good news for you because you will discard two cards, but you will soon recover. If you watch more videos. All right, so let's move on. We have a Snapping Nalid Soul Summons. Marble Diamond from Mirage. That's pretty cool. Pinnacle of Rage. Null Mage Shepherd. Life Smith. Spell Gorge of Weird. And this thing really pops in the foil version. Vespalark. And a foil Trial of Ambition. And the rare is actually a mythic master of cruelties. Nice. All right, so there we are, Carl. Thank you for being a patron. And Michael's mind is rotting. Oh, Michael Serta, ding, 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 ding. Super chat. Thank you, sir. Much appreciated. He says, greetings, everyone. Good to have you here. And who else do we have? I noticed Katie came in. All right, so I think I saw Katie's envelope here. Let me dig through. So what I've been doing is um, if the patrons are in the chat, I'll do their snap pack while they're here. Here we go. All right, Katie W, thank you for being a patron. And we are yet to pull a wild card. So maybe today is your lucky day. Still looking for those elusive wild cards. I'm not sure what's going on because I stuffed plenty of them in here. Got a foil and rare or mythic. All right, good luck, Katie. Thank you for being a patron. What do we have? Starfall, Netcaster Spider. Cabal Evangel, Geyserfield Stalker, Bloodstone Goblin, Creature Goblin Warrior, 2-2 two, two for 2, very nice, Veteran Cathar, Embodiment of Fury, Mayhem Devil, Embodiment of Agonies, okay, so an extra rare for you, Meteorite, Mask of Immolation Foil, and the rare is Safara Sky's Blade. Fantastic artwork. I've got this uh, in a play mat. Very cool. So there we are, Katie. Thank you for being a patron. And your mad bar 99 says he thinks that rotting dinosaur saw too many of my videos. Yes, not only did his mind rot, but his entire body. Okay, one of the perils of watching this channel, alas... Next, we have Benjamin Sullivan. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Where are the wild cards? I blame Ajani, right? I blame Ajani. 
because he's the only planeswalker here, so he gets the blame. Ajani, what have you done with the wild cards, man? Or not man, what are you? Cat? Cat guy? Cat dude? Whatever. Foils and a rare or mythic. Okay, Benjamin. What do we have? Starting off with Ulamog's Crusher. Ornery Goblin. Avon Sentry. Electrify. Goblin War Party. Assassin Strike. Gobbling Ooze. Wall of Blossoms. SPNK says someone's eventually going to pull the jackpot of wild cards. Ridge Scale Tusker. Vizier of the Scorpion. And a foil, Epicure of Blood. And rare is Temple of Epiphany. All right, very cool. And now we know why there are all these uh, things, temples and things that look like they could be associated with Theros because Theros is coming back. All right. So thank you for being a patron, Benjamin. I'm going to have a drink of water. My throat is dying. Okay, next up we have Eric Palanco. So I still need to do his... I think he is due for a Chaos box, actually. So that will be maybe tomorrow. I haven't got the schedule at hand, but I think that's what we... <laughs> SPNKS says. Goes and grabs wild cards put in. All the wild cards are actually in the boxes already. So... I don't know what's happening here. It's... Uh, where are they? Normally I have, seem to have an uncanny knack to just pull them out right away, but... Uh, welcome, Spencer Hennigan. Thank you for joining. So I'm going to say we're probably like... Uh, halfway through, two-thirds of the way through the patron snap packs. Okay, Eric, what do we have? Syndicate Messenger, Molten Birth, Dissenters Deliverance, Boreal Elemental, Miraza Behemoth, Haunted Cloak, Hungry Flames, Mycosynth Fiend, Regrowth, Warmonger's Chariot, and a foil Goblin Bird Grabber. There he is, holding on for dear life. He's probably going to take a chunk out of that bird's leg on the way. And the rare is Solemn Simulacrum. Very cool. So M12, I think that was another one from the Goodwill box. So thank you for being a patron, Eric. There we are. Okay, moving right along, we have Douglas H. Martins. Thank you for being a patron. Let's dig into it. And this box is thinning out, so I might have to switch back to the other one. I hope I have enough cards. I think I figured I'd need about 500 cards for this video, so I'm hoping there are enough there. Okay, Douglas, let's go. We have Grasping Thrall, Excavating Anurid, Grave Purge, Mental Agony, Enduring Sliver, Firebolt, Bond of Revival, Pendle Haven Elder, Horribly Awry, Infiltration Lens. Yes! Wild card! Ding, 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 ding! Extra rare and foil! Here we are, people! Okay, grab the foil and the extra rare. And of course, we had to replace the foil that this occupied. Let's set that wild card aside. And you get a... Mythic, yes, Metallurgic Summonings. Okay, from Kaladesh. And your foil is Topple the Statue. And the second rare is a Mythic, Cavalier of Gales. Nice, so I think that's the second Cavalier we've seen in this video. Fantastic pulls for Douglas. Thank you for being a patron, sir. 
Okay, next up we have Kim R. Thank you for being a patron. We're going to go back to this other box here. Okay, so commons, uncommons, dig in for a foil. Welcome, Simon Hill. Thank you for watching. What do we have here? Primal Hunt Beast. Scolding Devil. Prophetic Ravings. Triton Shore Thief. Glissner Elf. Dispense Justice. A Braid. There's a nice one from Hour of Devastation. From under the floor, blo floor floorboards. From under the floorboards. Very creepy artwork. That that's one of the few pieces of artwork in Magic that creeps me the heck out. Vanquish the Foul, Celestial Purge, Blood Burglar, and the rare is Nightpack Ambusher from M Twenty. And like I was saying earlier, if it's from M20, it's a rare. It's probably from Rudy. Rudy and his hairy arms pulled me a couple of ley lines of the void, so happy about that. Okay, Kim R, thank you for being a patron. Let's move on. New patron here, Julia Ryder. Gets her signed Jackalope Herd. Let's go and see what we can pull for you today, Julia. So the commons and uncommons and need to grab a foil and a rare or mythic Twilight Sieve predicts that Julia gets a wild card. Could be, we shall see. There's got to be, I think there's, what, there's probably like five more wild cards between these two boxes. We have Mother Bear, or actually, no, I think it's eight wild cards total. Numbing Dose, that's why I'm so surprised we haven't pulled any yet. Baldalian Mage, so this is from that mysterious set. Was that Fallen Empires? I think it was. Mist Intruder, Fertile Thicket. Flame Sweep. Oh, so a promo pack M20 card. Haven't seen too many of those. Duskdale Worm. Triton Tactics. Baron Moor. Ornithopter. Yeah, Twilight Sieve confirms. Fallen Empires. Yes. Frost Lynx Foil. And the rare. Another Mythic Mirror Pull. From Oath of the Gatewatch. Very nice. Okay, so there we are, Julia. Thank you for being a patron. Okay, who else? We have Tony Siriani. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Let's dig into the box. Holy cow, we're at an hour already. So I think we, I think we still probably have another hour to go. So for you who are sticking around, you have... Incredible fortitude and stamina. Okay, I think that's right. Three, four, five. Three, four, five, yep. And a foil. Come on, Tony. You've got to get some wild cards here. The people are hungry for wild cards. We have a benthic giant. Sarah's Blessing, uh, Weather Light, I think that is. Icor Claw Mirror, Boreal Elemental, Inspired Charge, Dark Slick Drake, Crystal Ball, and an extra rare chucked in here. Cultivator's Caravan, Gargoyle Sentinel, Jace's Ingenuity, Foil, Impeccable Timing, and that. Appears to be a Johnny. There you are, sir. Let's do a quick. Yes. Okay, that is a Johnny confirmed. And the rare is Mist Cutter Hydra. All right. So there we are, Tony. Thank you for being a patron, sir. 
Okay, who do we have next? We've got Malana McCann. Thank you for being a patron. Digging into the box once again. Still hunting for wild cards. I swear this is like the challenge. I thought I stuffed in so many, but... And a foil. And rare or mythic. All right, good luck, Malana. We have Scrapskin Drake, Reclaim, Slaughterhorn, Guardians of My Lettuce, Rock Smallers, Zalfran Decoy, Ritual of the Returned, Disfigure, Boonyard Worm. Oh, Cosmo's here. Yes, we did your uh, snap pack already. I think it was about 10 minutes ago. Boneyard Worm, Sand Strangler, and a Foil Stone Quarry, and the rare is Safara Sky's Blade. Okay, so we must have had a couple of those in the box this month. So thank you once again, Marlana, for being a patron. Okay, so next up we have Pierre Etienne Poulain. Thank you, sir, for being a patron. Yep, so you got something to look forward to on the replay, Cosmo. Yeah, Ink Junkie 101 says it's okay, Cosmo. Unpat was late to his own stream. Yeah, I was 15 minutes late. Actually, what a funny story, the uh, one of the packs I was looking for was yours, Cosmo, because I realized that the uh, the bundles I'm putting in the snap packs as well, and I'd forgotten about it just before the video, so I was hunting around for that. Okay, we have Ballynock Cohort, Ornithopter, so either revised or fourth or fifth edition. I think it was fourth edition from what I recall. Suture Priest. And I swear this looks like somebody has a cat grafted onto their soldier, uh, their soldier, their shoulder. And I don't know if you can see it there, but I, that looks like a cat to me. I don't know. Leave a note in the chat or comments if you agree. Firewild border post. Not sure about that set symbol still. Guardians of my lattice is back. Harsh scrutiny. Ordeal of Thassa. Unified Will, Aether Shield Artificer, Era of Innovation, and a Foil, Satyr Grove Dancer. And the rare is Graph Digger's Cage. Okay, so there we are, Pierre. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Okay, so next we have emblazoned aegis and he really did nicely this month got his uh, mythic edition garrick there very cool so let's see if we can supplement that with some other nice pulls and maybe a wild card or three that would be pretty crazy Okay, foil and rare. All right, good luck, sir. Emblazoned edges, we have Cyclops of One-Eyed Pass, Exposed to Daylight, Chained Throat Seeker, Fatal Fumes, Rot Feaster Maggot, feast your eyes on that splendid creature. I hope you're not eating breakfast, lunch, or dinner at this point. And an extra rare here, Bishop of Wings. Whoa, I'm flinging cards around. It's gotten to that point in the video. And you just so happen to get... Let me check that. Yeah, okay. Holy moly. Okay, you got, a, you got an extra mythic here. Captive audience. It was probably below a dollar, so that's why I put it in there. Dreadhorde Butcher, another extra rare. What is happening? Paragon of New Dawns, Sentry of the Underworld, Rakdos Roustabout, Foil, and the rare is Drowned Catacomb. Or I should say, and your like third or fourth rare. Okay, so there we are, Emblazoned Aegis. Thank you for being a patron. 
tuck that stuff aside and I need to move envelopes before they tip over. Alrighty. Next up we have Sebastian Blackwell. Thank you for being a patron. Let's dig into it. And we get a foil and a rare or mythic. Good luck, Sebastian. What do we have? Deep analysis with Nico Leboles, Slash Panther, Bone Splinters, Mind Rot. I've already warned you people, but you continue to watch. Actually, there's not as many of you now, so maybe the Mind Rot has done its job. But if you keep watching, I swear it will go away. It'll be all fine. Kozilek Sentinel, Bleeding Edge, and Rare Amulet of Safekeeping. So you get an extra one there. Law Broker, Prized Elephant, King of the Pride, Foil Shock, and the rare is Ley Line of Abundance. Okay, so I think that is the second Ley Line we've pulled today. So there we are, Sebastian. Thank you for being a patron. Okay, onward to Lou Jukes. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Let's dig into the boxes. SPNKS says his mind is beyond rot. I don't know if that's good or bad. It already rotted or it's still yet to rot. Okay, and a foil, and rare or mythic, and I did actually count the foils, I should have enough for everybody. There's a little touch and go there. Okay, Lou, what do we have? Commune with the gods, Oars of Guildgate, Glasses of Urza, nice, I think that is probably uh, the tap symbol. Is that fourth edition, or is that revised, not sure. Akum Flame Seeker, Dusk Legion Zealot, Eternal Skylord, Fleet Feather Cockatrice, Quickling, Demon's Horn, Fireball, and a foil Scuttle Mutt. Twilight Thief says it was revised. All right, and a rare Shifting Ceratops. Okay. So we'll set these aside for Lou. Alrighty, next we have Amzai Bros. Thank you for being a patron. Let's dig into the box again. And a foil and a rare or mythic. Okay, Amzai Bros. We have Fall of the Hammer, Blind Zealot, Blinding Soul Eater, Summerworld Vigilante, Opaline Unicorn, Holy Mantle, Burnished Heart, that's a buck or two, Tormod's Crypt, that's another one, Witch's Eye. Daring Buccaneer, and a Foil Ogre Jailbreaker, and rare is a Mythic Exquisite Archangel. Nice, from Aether Revolt. So there we are, Amzai Bros. Thank you for being a patron. And Ink Junkie 101 says, Can a mine be rotten or rotted if you are out of it already? That is a very good question. Um, I don't think you really know. I mean, the only the only known way to uh, figure it out is keep watching the videos. Maybe the answer will come to you. Next up, we need a whole stack of clown emojis in the chat or in the comment section because Jeremy Worden is here. All right, sir. 
Let's dig in and see if we can get you some crazy pulls and maybe a wild card or three. We're still hunting for wild cards. I don't know what happened to them. They're in here somewhere. There we are. A whole lot of clown emojis filling the chat. Hopefully YouTube won't flag that as spam. I'll have to manually like review them. Oh, that's uh, just somebody greeting uh, Jeremy. Okay, foil and a rare or mythic. Okay, Jeremy, what do we have? SP NKS, can your mind rot be cured if you've already watched every video? Yes, if you watch this one all the way through, I would say your mind rot is cured. Or is it? That's There's always that question, isn't there? Okay, scour all possibilities. Persistent petitioners. Battlewise Valor. Invasive species. Augur Spree. Invade the city. Fledgling Moor Core. What is that symbol? Um, time something or other. Time, is it Time Spiral? Is that the one? Murder. Aggravate. Tybalt's Rager. And a foil rare imprisoned in the moon. Nice from Eldritch Moon. And rare is another mythic Cavalier of Flame. I think that is the third Cavalier so far. Very cool. So there you are, Jeremy. Did very nicely for yourself this month. Okay, next up we have Ryan Patterson. And the box is like, uh, I need to, I'm going to put some foam things in here to help prevent that falling apart. Okay. And if anybody doubts there are wild cards in the box, this is one we have pulled. We're still looking for the rest. I don't know. There should be... So there's like four extra rares, two standard packs, and two extra rare and foil. So what is that, eight total? And we only found one. This is getting ridiculous. Okay, Ryan, we have Anal, Thrashing Moss Dog, Gallant Cavalry... Shoulder to shoulder, Cloudfin Raptor, Hazardous Conditions, Welcome Depression Free, he's new to my channel, loves my videos, thank you. Uh, Solidarity of Heroes. Yes, he is here still, in case you were wondering, Master Splicer, Spore Crown Thalad, Bleeding Edge, and a Foil Vampire Warlord. That is pretty cool. And rare is a mythic God Eternal Bond 2. Look at that face. Zombie God. Fantastic. So this is probably, I'm going to say, either the best pull or second best. We did pull a Khan. So I'm not sure if Khan from War of the Spark or this guy is better. Probably this guy. So there we are, Ryan. Excellent pulls for you today, sir. Thank you for being a patron. And next we have Bozza from Down Under. My old homeland. Haven't been back in a long time, unfortunately. It's been about 10 years at this point. So let's see. Four, five... Okay, so those, and then a foil, and a rare or mythic. All right, Bozza, where are the wild cards? We need to get you a wild card, Bozza. SPNKS, no wild cards have been pulled. We just pulled that one earlier that you already saw. Alas, okay, Knight of the Stampede, Return Phalanx, Stomper Cub, Plummet, Grim Roustabout, Suspicious Bookcase, Not of This World, 
Cudgel troll, we have been trolled. Bozza, you have been trolled. Ravenous giant. Mind claw shaman. Get a foil island from M20. And the rare is Decimate from Conspiracy. Okay. So there we go, Bozza. Let's tuck these aside for you. And up next, we have Eric Kinsey. Ooh, that snake's pretty cool. Leave a note in the comments what you think of the Ice Fang Coatl. I've heard that one's doing some good stuff. Okay, two, three, four, and five. Spoiler. One, two, three, four, and four. Five. At this point, I'm getting a little concerned. Do I even have enough cards in the boxes? I know I've got enough rares and foils. That's not a problem. But the other stuff, I do have piles of bulk next to the table here. So I can dig those up if needed. Okay, recruit the worthy. Lagona Band Elder. <clears throat> Losing my voice. Bubbling Muck. So this is from Urza's. Moorland Inquisitor, Loyal Cathar, flips around into a unhallowed Cathar. Okay, then. Zombie Soldier, Blood Cursed Knight, Oval Chase Daredevil, Gleaming Overseer, Blizzard Strix, Nemesis of Mortals, and a foil Stromkirk Captain. And the rare is Phyrexian Revoker. Look at that thing. I like his grin there. He's got this weird little fiendish grin. It's supposed to be like a mechanical spider or something. That's weird. All right, so there we are, Eric. Thank you for being a patron. Okay, next we have Paper Time. And look at that. Paper Time. Do you really need anything else from this video? Can we really do better than that? I would be very surprised, but... Think surprises have happened before. You could get a wild card. So we got five there. All right. And foil. And rare. Okay, paper time. We're going to supplement that ley line of the void today with a wing steed rider, rotted hystrix. Reclaiming Vines, Blossom Dryad, Armored Pegasus from 6th edition, Phalanx Leader, Air Elemental, Renegade Will Smith, Flux Channeler, Birthing Bows, and a Foil Promo, Grand Warlord Radha from 2018, and the rare is Life Crafter's Bestiary. Very cool. Okay, so there we are, paper time. Nothing so crazy as that ley line of the void, but I think you did rather well this month. Okay, now let's see how many more patrons we've got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine to go. Holy moly. This is going to be an epic video. Okay, Patrick McLaughlin, new patron, signed Jackalope Herd. Let's dig into the other box here. And a foil and a rare. Okay, good luck, Patrick. Thank you for being a patron. What are you at? Uh, Goblin Electromancer. Fantastic pull. Farbog Explorer. Attacker Beast Breaker. And I'm skipping cards now. Razor Tip Whip. Corrosive Ooze. Battle Brawler. Farbog Bone Flinger. What is up with the Farbogs here? Holy moly. Tormod's Crypt. Back to Nature. Holt Order. 
Scamp, oh, that is a foil. Whoa, scampering scorcher. Love that foiling. And the rare is Marauding Raptor. Okay, so we pulled a dino for you. So thank you for being a patron, Patrick. Yeah, so uh, Depression Free asks what sets are we opening right now? So this is stuff going back to, what is the oldest? We've had like Fallen Empires. This is just stuff that I've pulled on the channel that I give back to patrons with these snap packs. So if you're at the right tier, you get a patron snap pack. Yep, so SPNKS says five random commons, uncommon, foil, and rare. Okay, next patron we have Soul Trap 102. New patrons signed Jackalope Herd. Sooner or later, people, we are going to pull some wild cards. It's like pulling teeth at this point. Holy moly. And speaking of teeth, my uh, my son will be getting his braces on at the end of the month. So that's going to be an interesting time. My bank balance will be having an interesting time as well. But we will never fear. The patrons are keeping the channel going. So we're all set in that respect. No worries there. Okay. Soul Trap 102, we have Fairy Seer. Cemetery Recruitment, and don't go with Liliana. She'll hose you every time. Cultivate, that's a good one. Artifice's Assistant, Fountain of Icor, Tribute Mage, Thornscape Battle Mage, and an extra rare here, Loxodon Life Chanter. Maybe that's the deal. The extra rares keep popping up, so I don't need to pull any for patrons, but most, yeah, most of these are like under a dollar. Resplendent Griffin, Mayhem Divi, Foil Rare, another Foil Rare, Voracious Hydra, and the Rare is a Mythic, Azor the Lawbringer, Sphinx, there he is, one of the weirder tribes of magic. Okay, there we are, Soul Trap 102, thank you for being a patron, sir. Next up, we have Neil Ellis. Thank you for being a patron. We're going to keep digging here for wild cards. Okay, so five of those. And a foil and a rare. And Depression Free says, Been in Magic since Eldritch Moon, my first set. That is a pretty nice set. It's one of my favourite ones, I would say. It's got the similar theme to Innistrad. Um, and Innistrad is my favourite set, even though I didn't start playing until Armenket. Okay, next we have Sage's Row Denizen, Skeleton Archer, Kazmina's Transmutation, Goblin Motivator, and this is how the goblins motivate you. They give you a whack in the head like so, and that corrects your motivation problems. Primal Visitation, Twilight Sieve was uh, playing at the time of Revised. Whoa. Rubber Welt Rioters, Talisman of Resilience, and an extra rare here, Undercity Plague. Oh, finally. All right, extra rare wild card coming right up. Let's sneak that back there. Okay, so we were wondering where these were. Next we have Death Reap Ritual. Foil Summit Sprint. And a mythic, Kalia Zenith Seeker. And I always think that is an angel. Aren't those... Oh, there's like angel wings and demon wings, but she's a human cleric. Okay, I guess that fits in with what it's saying here. Okay, so very cool, Paul. And your second rare. Very nice. Lotus Field. You are cooking with gas, Mr. Ellis. Okay, so congratulations to Neil. He got some nice pulls today. Okay, next up we have Twilight's Eve. And already got a Xenagos Planeswalker. That was a cool pull. 
So let us continue digging for wild cards. I might have to switch to the other box again. This these boxes get so thinned out; it takes me so long to fill them again. I don't, I don't just t chuck random bulk in. I sort of sort through it and pick up the interesting cards. Okay, we have Humungulus, the Humungulus, Nylea's disciple, Primal Druid, Excavation Elephant, Corrosive Ooze, Jace's defeat, Halgeist. SPNKS says his favourite tribes are zombies and vampires. And Depression Free made a whole commander date with only angels. Love angels. And I don't think anybody needs to guess too hard to know my favourite tribe. Okay, next we have a Fallen Shinobi Zombie Ninja. Not sure how well that would work out for him. Grave Robber Spider. Okay, an extra rare Soul Flayer. And a very tasty Simic Growth Chamber. Love that foiling. And the rare is a Prowling Serpopard. Yes, that is a cat snake. If you've never seen one before, it can be a little disturbing. They do have some haunches there and a tail like a snake, but it curves like a cat. Very weird. All right, there we are, Twilight Sieve. Thank you for being a patron. Okay, next up we have Daniel E. Coop. Thank you for being a patron and got some shiny goodness there. Okay. Okay, five commons. And uncommons. And grabbing a foil. And a rare or mythic. All right, Daniel, good luck, sir. We have Lost in a Labyrinth. Artillerize. Welcome, Carl. Yep, I can't wait to unpack Throne. There is going to be a ridiculous amount of Throne of Eldraine content. We're actually going to be cracking a collector's box with the collector boosters. So the patrons were very interested in that, so I was able to pick one of those up. Okay, Punish the Enemy, Remember the Fallen, Twin Bolt, we got a Watley the Sun's Heart, Planeswalker, Soul Herder, I think that was over, over a buck, Thunderclap Wyvern, Vampire Charm Seeker, Narset Parter of Veils, that is another nice pull, and a Foil Hypersonic Dragon. And your rare is Chandra Acolyte of Flame. Nice, from M20. And I believe this one was pulled by Rudy from Alpha Investments. So I got two boxes of Core 2020 and he opened those up for me, sent me the rares, mythics and foils. Very cool. All right. And what else do we have here? Uh, Depression Free says you like the Eldritch Moon set. What do you think of Emrakul? So I'm not quite sure on the lore there. What is Emrakul about? Is that uh, one of the old? Oh, not Eldrazi. Emrakul is those um, tentacle guys, right? So let's see. You've got four patrons left. We have Ronald De Petro, and if you have not checked out his channel. MTG Ronnie D, go there right now, subscribe. This guy puts in so much hard work. He's done tons of pack openings, craziness. All right, so check it out. Good luck, Ronald. Thank you for being a patron. And I'll have to uh, put a link to his channel in the description for this video as well once I'm done here. Make that a bit easier to find. Okay, and a foil and a rare or mythic. We have Nylea's Presence, Morgburst, Inspiring Captain, 
Oh, what is that? Ornithopter. Um, I think that was fourth edition. Orcish Cannonade. Slice in Twain. Phalanx Leader. Dismantling Blow. Chandra's Triumph. Yes! Wild card for Ronald. Fantastic. Okay, we've been wondering where they were. And when you dig down so many cards, you're going to find some wild cards. Okay, so we'll set that aside. And a foil captivating crew promo. That's pretty shiny from 2017. And a mythic Eros God of Victory. Fantastic. Incredible pull. Okay, there we are, Ronald. And your second rare is a Dread Presence. Follow me into the woods, please, and I will show you something. No, thank you, sir. I think I'll stand right here and continue putting together the patron snack packs. Thank you for being a patron, Ronald. Um, so let's see, we've got three wild cards. I think we have five more wild cards buried here somewhere. Okay, three more patrons, well actually two more patrons, but three more snapbacks. We have Travis Taylor. Thank you for being a patron, sir. Let's dig into it. Oh, of course. Okay, Depression Free Emrakul, The Promised End. 1313 card. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. I do remember people playing that back in the day. And uh, it was astonishing, this huge, uh, what is he, like a big tentacle beast? Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I thought I miscounted there. And a foil and a rare for Travis. Okay, so we're over an hour and a half now. So you people who have been here the whole time, you are incredible. Thank you very much. Let's go. We have Minotaur Skull Cleaver, Gravel Hide Goblin, and I'm going to have to drink some water after this. Skullkin, Lavakin Brawler, Depths of Desire, Rage Blood Shaman, extra rare thrown in there. Very nice. Sightless Brawler, Agent of Treachery, another rare. Okay. Strong Arm Monk, Lanawar Tribe, and this guy. Butcher's Glee! Look at that face! And sadly, I don't think he would make for a very good butcher. He would be tearing into the meat all the time. Or maybe that's the point. Okay, and the rare is Field of the Dead from M20. Okay, another one I think Rudy pulled that. So thank you for being a patron, Travis. Okay, I need to have a quick drink of water. Okay, so we have one more patron. <clears throat> one more patron with two snap packs. That is Matthew Arkhambo. Thank you for being a patron, sir. See if we can finish off with a huge pile of wild cards. That'd be pretty funny. We got them all at the beginning last month. And if we get them all at the end, that would be interesting. SPNKS has had enough, yes. Well, you will miss all the wild cards, sir. I'm sorry. Thank you for dropping by. Um, maybe his mind rotted. But I'm pretty sure he's joking. Okay. <laughs> Light Quatorze, thank you for dropping by. We have found a wild card. And let's see what Ajani's been doing this whole time. Ajani has been ready and waiting for this moment. He has blessed the packs. He has blessed them vigorously. Okay. So we have a vigorously blessed pack. Standard pack there for Matthew. Let's set that aside. Okay. 
We'll crack that in a moment. And the patron get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. Fling! That's pretty cool. Reign of Revelation. Loathsome Katobal Pass. Katobal Pa. How do you say that? Leave a note in the comments. I have no idea. Timber Pack Wolf. Grave Blade Marauder. An extra rare. So, extra, extra rare. That's a bit too rare for my liking. Nissa's Triumph. And Carl says, love the Chaos Booster Box, by the way. Yep, those are a lot of fun. District Guide. Cyclops Electromancer. Vengeful Rebel. And a Foil Scythe Leopard. And a mythic Vivian Arcbow Ranger. Very cool pull for Matthew. All right. Now we're going to crack a pack of Corset 2020. Got a Soren there. Uh, this is actually the first pack I have cracked today. Nothing like it. Because the one, uh, the video this morning I filmed yesterday. So. Oh, we're off to a great start with a Goblin Bird Grabber. Very nice. Daybreak Chaplain, Fortress Crab, Barony Vampire, Plummet. Unholy Indenture, Fantastic Artwork, Seb McKinnon, Griffin Sentinel, Agonizing Siphon, Frost Lynx, Pack Mastiff, Uncommon's Flame Sweep, Angel of Vitality, Rule of Law, and the rare is Leyline of Sanctity. Very nice enchantment for four. If it's in your opening hand, you may begin the game with it on the battlefield. You have Hexproof. So there we are, Matthew. And a Jungle Hollow and an Elemental Bird token. Okay, so that is pretty cool. I'll set those aside. All right. Thank you for being a patron, sir. But wait, there's more. You have another snack pack. So let's see if you can clear out the remaining wild cards. So there we are. SP and KS, what does your family think when they hear your funny voices? They honestly don't bat an eyelid because that is... Uh, I know people think I'm putting this on. This is... I mean, it is a bit of a performance really, but... Um, I'm pretty goofy normally, so I'm always making weird voices and stuff, so they, they honestly, uh, it doesn't surprise them. They just shrug, they're like, oh yeah, that's, that's him, yep. Okay, so ten. And a foil and a mythic. Will we clean out the wild cards here? We have a Nimbus Naiad, Brightwood Tracker, Riot Piker, Creature Goblin Berserker, very nice. Lens of Clarity, Macabre Waltz, that is quite sickening actually. Mayhem Devil, Monvoili Beast Tracker, Crypt Rats, yes! Been a while since I've seen some rats. Fantastic. Whirlamaker. Corrupt. Ooh, a foil promo rare. Sigiled Sword of Valoron. That is blinding. Whoa. And the rare is Solemnity. Nice. So we pulled another one of those earlier in the video. No need to apologize, Carl. Uh, just watching the video is enough. Um, glad to see you guys all here. All right, so there we are, Matthew. That is your second snap pack. And let's get a quick look at the table so you can see I've been moving these um, piles of cards out of the way. Here is the... This is also the set for Pop Sideshow. As you can tell, there's been a bit of Pennywise madness this month. So there we go. And here is Ajani. Hopefully got us the great pulls. And stay tuned. So over the next week, we still have a bunch more patron videos. And then I 
think, hopefully, fingers crossed, starting next weekend will be the Throne of Eldraine Madness. So I'm hoping to pick up a couple of booster box. We've got a collector's booster box. Um, and then the following week, the bundle, I think the Planeswalker decks have also pre-ordered the, um, the Brawl decks. Absolutely ripped off on those, but I had to get them in time for the channel. So stay tuned for all of that. Thanks for watching and have a great day.